What is going on you guys? It's your guys, Senpai Riot, and as you see, and as you know, if you've been keeping up with my channel, I acquired Ming yesterday, pitying her. But this is not that video. Today, 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 we are going to summon 30 times, or 300 times, with 30 multis, to acquire Hotaru. Now, Ming Banner, out of here. Never want to see you again. Anna Banner, you are kind to me, and a second pull. All these other banners, I have them all. Like they're goddamn Pokemon. Now, Frontiva, uh, you are a hard pass, even though I have over 30,000 Gnosis shards right there, because you're gonna turn to Anna. This girl right here. Not even joking when your timeline ends in 31 days and some change. Nikola, I need two copies of you. Almost at copy number one, because I donate diamonds every day instead of gold. How about that? But today's summon is for this sweetheart right here. The one with almost no <laughs> uh, real expressions on her face besides a basic smiley face. As everybody sees, Hotaru, a member of the Phoenix, you will help me in Miracle. And these are some of the other items that you can acquire. Now, this summoning session is different because, well... There is still a guaranteed pity, like the selected ticket banner, so it's kind of the same but different. Because you you can't acquire this character beforehand, and through these summons so far in the game are the only ways to pull them unless you pull them at your first guaranteed SSR newbie pull. At the very beginning, yes, I got Frantiva, which is a curse and a blessing. Now, let me show you what the KR timeline looks like for these banners, real quick. Okay, you guys, this is what you need to know. For the Gnosis banner, the one which features Frontiva right now, it will change into Anna after it resets in about a month and a half from this point, at least for my account's timeline. Now, Frontiva sucks. More power to anybody that enjoys using her, but if you want to win... Oh, God. Wait for Anna. Just, 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 just wait for Anna. She is a much stronger choice. And as you will see, and I've done my research, after you use up the 300 pulls, which is equivalent to 30 multis, you will have a reset on whatever character banner you have where you have to essentially do it all over again in order to get a duplicate of that character. Now, the summon banner that I am on today is for the honor banner, the one in the middle. Now, for the honor banner, as you know, it's going to be Hotaru. Hotaru later turns into Gagaku, or I like to call her Lady Gaga. It has more of a ring to it. Gives her a little bit more flair when she plays her goddamn flute and summons those spirit puppies, which are annoying as hell. Whenever you kill them, they um, typically do damage, which is not always the funnest thing to put up with. But, yeah, that's that. That's a mid-player, mid-player type of banner. Whenever Hotaru gets enough of an awakening or enough of a lens upgrade, I should say, for this specific game, she will be able to summon more spirit puppies. Hence, she's a summoner, does more damage, but personally, I am waiting for, or waiting, I'm not waiting, I'm trying to acquire the enforcers actively because I'm literally two shards, two or three shards away. Like, I have a five spot on Hersey. On paper, I have 52 or 53 shards over. After I pop the five from Hersey, I'm at like 57 or 58. So I'm just waiting. And yet again, I haven't clicked on Hersey because I want to share that epic moment with you guys. Because I'm an A1 content creator again. What can I say? Now, for the contribution banner, moving right along, everybody. Right now, it's Nicola or Nicholas. But that sounded probably more like a masculine version of the name. So, NKR, they changed it to Nicola. Which, I don't know, Nicola. Kind of a sexy little name for a vampiric redhead. I don't know these things. <laughs> but, anywho, Nicola is meh until you get her up to like five or six stars then she is able to hit three different characters as opposed to two similarly to hachishiki and she reduces the other person's damage resistance i believe or defense damage resistance or defense either which way they take more dps which is awesome now right below her you could kind of make out how it says angela because 
according to this page. It kind of cut off a little bit. I apologize for that, but it is all there as you guys see. Now, when Nicola turns it to Angela, Angela is good. I have a copy of her. Went all the way to pity for her. That video definitely exists. I'm ashamed to say. <laughs> but whenever you do get her, um, she has this little cool thing where she ta she's a taunt tank. And then she has a revive of one of your characters that essentially has obviously died. It is random is what it seems, but she has a cool little aim on side ability, just letting you guys know. And she gets better at five and six stars as everybody else probably also knows. But Nicola is a stronger character and I've been giving her different diamonds instead of regular gold for the contribution summons every day to up my chances because I'm trying my damnedest to leave with two copies of Nicola. But now that y'all know how this banner works, enough stalling, you guys. Let's jump right into the honor banner and summon 300 times and acquire Hotaru. It is officially time. Let's go. And we are officially back, everybody. Not going to waste any more time. I just merely wanted to enlighten everybody about the future upcomings of the different Honor, Gnosis, and Contribution Summon. But enough delay. Delaying. Shall we officially begin? Oh, I hope I get an off-brand SSR unit which doesn't exist because that's not in any kind of right in the banner. Okay, Nightmare Robe. Let's see, increase defense by 1%. Incoming attacks have a 50% chance of restoring 1% of HP. God damn. That's actually not a bad piece of gear. I will utilize it. <laughs> uh, okay. Summon times 20. And a jewel hairband. Uh, is that Hashishiki's weapon? It is. And she almost needs this to not stun herself. And of course, it gives a nice overall attribute boost. Pharaoh's boots. Not a bad pair, but going SSR gear. Yeah, here, that's the direction we are taking now. We all know that the um, different resources are very, very valuable in this game, especially after you get to higher levels, because you will hit resource wall after resource wall, and that seeds holy seal is not an item, it's an affinity item, not a piece of equipment. Moving on to the next one right now, but any kind of any kind of way to save on gear is a godsend later on in this game so i only touch the purple gear if they were amazing i want to say and uh, but for most of my um gameplay i absolutely went into the higher tier ssr gear like this one for instance i think i have this piece on kasumi but it is a nice piece of equipment. So typically how I like to do it is have about at least three different pieces of the gear before I start synthing them into each other. But in a lot of different um, aspects of this game, I have been extremely blessed. Like, you know that Wanda Hope, or the what, Staff of Hope, the one for my how to obtain different SSR gear very quickly, get it like I get it type of video? Uh, yeah, you should check it out, because uh, I guess what some would call me is a dolphin. <laughs> Those are such stupid effing terms, you guys. Oh, he's a dolphin! He's a whale! F that noise. I'm a shark. I dolphin out a little bit, but I'm much smarter than a dolphin. Because whenever I see something that could extremely benefit my account while keeping it economic, I eat. I guess if we're making up stupid animal terms, I'm a goddamn shark. What you think about that, everybody? Now, shall we continue? Because, ooh, okay, Fenna Beth, what's good? Can't wait to never use you. Meh. I cringe every time. You are gorgeous. Don't, don't, don't get me twisted. She is a gorgeous bit. She absolutely is. But there are better people to be had in the roster. Now for the last under 10, let's go, as you see, oh, there's another Pharaoh's Boots. Let's go with the single summons. And, okay, hold on one second. We should be right about there, right about now, with one honor point left, or one honor summon left. 31 days, so everything else is going to uh, be put into the next summoning unit. And again, Save on Frantiva. Spend on Anna. Oh my god! 
Holy effing S, you guys. I got me an SSR unit. Hold a room. Smile, girly. That's what I always wanted. My life is complete. Uh, the collector in me is overjoyed. Ah, oh, that's actually kind of a cool picture, too. Let's run that one. That might actually be the thumbnail that everybody sees in the beginning of the video. But, like all great things, and a little Miss Hodoru, I will... Uh, because of Miracle, well, you see it resetting. Let's just go like that. You see how it reset all the way to 99. And since one summon is 300 Ooh. seed badges and... 10 is 3,000. I really didn't miss out on anything by going the one times route. But again, you guys, as you know, delayed gratification built the middle class, and I have been saving this specific video all the way untouching the seeds summoning banner for you guys. And make sure that you use these boxes because they give gold, nightmare bottle L's, and of course, the purple ginseng in order to get your SSR gear. Ooh. I think it was Nightmare Hunter for a few days and it turned into like a, a block increasing crown which costs 80,000 instead of 40,000 but it's amazing it resets every two days and Nightmare Hunter reset every one day. But on that note I will call it a close to this video everybody. I have hoped that everybody has also thoroughly enjoyed my material. Again this is your guy Senpai Rai. Check me out at Patreon at patreon.com backslash YT Senpai Rai and look out for my amazing videos both in IC and KOF All-Star and right after this I'm gonna cut an amazing video in that ASAP because they think I'm cheating on them with you guys but I love it and I love y'all so drawing the video to a close again this has been your guys Senpai Rai and I'm out you guys love you all peace <laughs>